What you got, Paul? Paul, what you got? What do we have here? We have, hopefully not the death of a bot. So number one, what is this plane? So this is the JNH Aerospace Microbot, or uh, totally not a micro bird of time, in case there's any copyright stuff still. It's not, don't worry about that. So but right. the bottom line is, let me check that out. So, somebody said something about rocket bot, and I said, you're on. So, we're doing it. Um, blame Ross. Yes, hashtag blame Ross, also hashtag send it. Um, which is also hashtag blame Ross. So the deal here is some of you are going to rightfully look at this and say, Josh, you have a beautiful sailplane that you're potentially going to destroy. Why in the world would you do this? Well, the answer is you're going to have to wait for 2021, which will hopefully be better than 2020. And then you will see that this actually um, is sort of a preliminary experiment. And we'll just leave it at that. Let me check over everything here. Zero pre-flights are required, you know. So he did fly this yeah, uh, well, RC power. Go ahead and for the okay. sake of camera footage and stuff. So it's not what I would call happy with this thing on here. I mean it glides okay. Um, but there's, there's some turbulence and whatnot over the tail surfaces, so, the, um, well, we'll get it going so it gets unhappy. Yeah, so it's, it's a little unhappy if I really start yanking on things, but we should be safe. It's not going to get going super fast under rocket power, so in theory, this will work okay. So, uh, you? so um, for those wondering exactly what the setup is, this is an Aerotech 18 millimeter reload, so it's an Aerotech 1820 casing. Um, it has a C2.3 load in it, so, the, uh, sorry, C3.2, I get those mixed up, as there's a, a C and a D reload. We're running a T-motor, um, it's a, let me get the, this is a new one that they came out with. It's an F1303 5000 kV on a 4.5 inch prop which will be carrying that spe that specific size in the store soon because I, I think the smaller props are a little better on these. And then this is the electric pod that's just been cut down. Um, the amount of thrust that this rocket will make is far below what I what I can just feel on this pod, so we, we should be good there. There is some down thrust effect, but the reason this is angled down is to get that thrust line closer to my vertical center of gravity, so that actually gives me less down pitching moment than if it were just aligned there. Also, it's set up to, give my, to put my thrust over the top of my tail, so hopefully I won't scorch my rudder too much, because the tail on this plane is kind of short, and so that's a little bit of an issue. So with that said, uh, we're going to hook this guy up, and we're going to clear the range of kittens and kids, I hope. All right, going in five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> okay, I don't really like how that flies under rocket power. Like, I hate it. <laughs> But it does, in fact, fly. <laughs> also, my kids apparently adore it. 
There we go. <laughs> Gotta admit, that was kind of fun. Yeah, well, I have learned some interesting things from that experiment, none of which really surprised me. It doesn't glide half bad, even with that stupid thing up there. I mean, that's not bad. And it's weighed down with all the extra stuff. The best part of all of this, though, is... We can go back up again. <laughs> the rocket bot lives on. So tell me, what did you think of Daddy's rocket? Oh, rocket. Rocket. The ring was hiding somewhere. Yeah, but what Just tell about the rocket. rocket. What'd you think of the rocket? It was good. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I feel hurt. Did you like it? Uh -huh. Was it fast? It was not yeah. fast. It was but slow. That one was okay. slow. Oh, look. Yeah? Did it launch up in the sky, Paul? <laughs> Tell me what what do you gotta do what do you gotta do at a rocket launch? Rocket. You gonna count to three? He's right. Paul. It did go back that way yeah. on its back. Because daddy's a bad pilot. <laughs> Paul say one, two, three, launch. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, the rocket went back there. <laughs> Can you say touchdown? But did Clemson get a touchdown? Say touchdown. Daddy's work. Daddy work. Oh well. Oh yeah. Don't. Hi, I'm Josh Finn. This is Hope. We are J&H Aerospace. If you like this video, hit the like button. Also, how about subscribe to our channel and check out jhaerospace.com for new free flight products and all of the tooling that you'll need to build them. Thanks for watching.